Hi everyone, you have just tuned in to Second Chance Chat, and I'm your host, Pastor J.L. Bruce, pastor of the Second Baptist Church in Holland, Ohio. For those who are, this is your first time tuning in to this medium, Second Chance Chat is a medium that will give you an opportunity to chat back with the pastor by inboxing me uh, based on the subject matter that we talk about. Because I would like to hear your opinion or even hear your thoughts about what we discuss. And I would like also just for you to give me some insight on maybe some solutions to the things that we talk about. So today we want to talk about the word transition. How do you manage transition? What does transition mean? Simply change. But it doesn't mean uh, simply just changing something. It means moving from one place to another. Uh, that's the difficult part. I can change, but I don't want to move or, uh, or go from one place to another. I like to use this analogy, letting go of the old to get to the new. You have to know that change is probably one of the most difficult things for anybody to do because we become familiar with our surroundings which gives us a comfort level and because of that when change starts to take place we have a tendency to fight against it or matter of fact we just totally refuse to change but you got to understand everything changes and no matter how hard you may fight against it, everything changes. There's a saying that the only thing that is constant is change. So, like it or not, something's going to change. Think about it. I want you just think about this for a minute. What have you fought against, trying hard for it not to change? Um, now, I'm like you. I'm getting older. And yeah, I do a few things to try not to uh, look as old, maybe change my clothes or wear different styles of clothes or uh, you know, just things and try to keep myself up. But the reality of it is my body is still going to change. I mean, that's true. That's, y'all say, well, we're past going. That's reality. And, and, but this is the thing about change. When you're changing something, that means you're leaving something here to go to something there. And that the key is this. When we talk about from a spiritual perspective, we're leaving something old to get to something new. But watch this. Before we can get to the new, there's another section or a process that we have to go through called the neutral position, which means if I leave the old, which I'm letting go of something, I gotta go to the neutral position to get to the new beginning. And this is where all the work is done. In that neutral position is where my mindset has to be changed. I want you to think about this. Some of you have found yourself in a state of unproductivity, which means nothing is happening in your life. You know why? Because some of you are still stuck in the neutral position. God has been trying to change something in you, and you have refused to change, which now you become unproductive. So everybody has to go through this neutral position in order to get to the new beginning because this is where the work is done. This is where the process of changing how we think, how we talk, how we walk. It's important for us to understand that because once you get through the neutral position, now you're ready for the new beginning. The reason you can't go from old to new just like that, because you're going to bring some of that old stuff into the new. And God don't need that old stuff. That's why he's trying to get you from one place to the next. So I want you to think about that. Transition means change from something old to something new. But before I get there, i got to go through the neutral process. i got to get rid of some stuff in me in order to celebrate and enjoy that new beginning. I'd like to hear your thoughts. Can you inbox me and tell me what 
you feel and what you think about the word transition and even about the word change. I'm going to wait to hear from you. Until next week, God bless.